can you tell us more information? Like thank you all for uh, yeah. Coming up in today's show, track is having an informational meeting tomorrow, and the boys are back from Metropolitan Walk with a snowball story. Today we're coming back. Hey Vikes, I'm Lindsay. And I'm Emma. And you're watching SVTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. Tickets for Battle of the Bands are on sale during all lunches this week. Tickets are $3 at lunch and $5 at the door. There is also a ticket t-shirt combo for sale. Juniors, applications are now being accepted for internship program. You can find them on the Class of 2021 Schoology page. If you have any questions, please contact Mrs. Noble. FCCLA districts were last Wednesday, and we had a multiple people advance to the state competitions in April. Congratulations to those members. Key Club members, be sure to check your Schoology page today and vote for the next year's club officers. Voting will close at 5 p.m. Attention seniors, please stop to the counselor's office and see Ms. Conley. We are verifying information for diplomas and want to make sure that everything is correct. If you've received a scholarship, also make sure you stop by the counselor's office. Now over to Emma with sports. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. February 20th. Blast off. With the Battle of the Bands. One night only. Sweet intergalactic rock and roll. Knock you out of your orbital rotation. Featuring all of your favorite bands. Live in the Seaman High School Auditorium. Untamed Mustangs. Crybaby Green Beans. Dragon Shredders. No Toe. Right Side Down. Tickets on sale during all lunches beginning February 12th. $3 in advance. $5 at the door. We'll sell you the seat. But you won't need it. Because you'll be floating in zero Gs. All night long. long. Proceeds benefit the SHS Thirst Project. There will be a preseason track informational meeting tomorrow in room 925 after school for anyone interested in participating in track and field this spring. Autumn caught up with Coach Weens to learn more about it. Hey Vikes, I'm here with Mr. Weens today to tell us some more information on the track meeting tomorrow after school. Can you tell us some more information? Uh, yeah, tomorrow, which will be Wednesday uh, after school, uh, we're going to have uh, just a really informal meeting um, in room 925, which is Mr. Brock's room. Used to be Mr. Ruda's room if you uh, had Success 101 earlier down at the end of the freshman hall. Um, and we'll just go over some really uh, basic information, kind of what to expect, um, uh, uniforms, and a little bit about uniforms and apparel, things like that. If you miss it, we'll uh, send a lot of that information out through Schoology anyway, so don't worry. If you're involved in a, a winter sport and you're still doing that, great. Um, but we'll be happy to give you that stuff and I hope we see some uh, really high quality faces. Okay, thank you. Make sure you go to the track meeting if you're interested. If you're interested, please make sure to attend the meeting. Last weekend was the final competition of the season for the JV wrestling team. The Vikes finished 12 and 36 in total matches. Braylon Dorsey and Raiden Wilson both took third place medals with two and two records, and Zach Jowers finished four and zero and captured an individual title. Great job, boys! The boys swim team placed third at league, scoring 390.5 points. Congratulations to Noah Florence. Colin O'Rourke and Devin Applehands for placing first team all league and Aiden Florence and Zach Bloom for placing second team all league. There will be a boys golf informational meeting in Mr. Reinberg's room E1 for those interested in trying out during activity period on Thursday. An auxiliary band dance clinic will be held Saturday April 4th in the Seaman High School North Gym from 830 to 11 a.m. Tryouts will be from 12 to 2 p.m. the same day. If you have any questions, contact Ms. Hurt. Wednesday at 1.15, Susanna Mosquito will sign a letter of intent to play soccer at Benedictine College. Congratulations, Susanna. There is a basketball game today at Topeka West, and the theme is Lumberjacks. Friday's game is at Emporia, and the theme will be Hawaiian. It felt great outside today. Let's go to, see, let's go to Josh to see if this weather will stay breezy. <laughs> Thank you. 
Good afternoon to you. Our high temperature yesterday was 65 degrees and that's the warmest we've been in over two weeks. But if you notice the wind picked up yesterday evening and a cold front has passed through and that's going to start to lower our temperatures over the next few days. So today our high 46, that's about 20 degrees colder, still not bad by February standards. But you can see our cloud coverage pretty low today on the sunny side and temperatures falling back into the upper 30s by the time we get to 7 p.m. this evening. Then our attention turns to our next weather maker, which is set to arrive on Wednesday. It'll bring snow across portions of western and southern Kansas. And then here, this is Wednesday night, Thursday at 2 a.m., we could have a few flurries in the area. There's a lot of dry air due to an area of high pressure, but we could see just a little bit of snow coming up Wednesday night. By far the better chance of moisture arrives for the second half of the upcoming weekend. This is on Sunday. A low pressure system will track in from the west and bring widespread area of light to moderate rainfall across much of the state of Kansas. That's coming up for you on Wednesday and checking out the seven day forecast. Here it comes that colder weather. 33 is our high on Thursday, but at least we have mostly sunny skies to deal with and then warmer this weekend highs in the 40s and 50s ahead of that rain chance on Sunday. Now Emma and Lindsay back to you. Thanks Josh. Snow, snow, snow. I love snow and the boys are back in town for the snowfall safari. Hi bikes. Today we're coming back for a special winter themed episode. With all the snow around, we thought we could go explore in the snow. Come along! Choo choo! Oh god! God, get it! Get out of the way! Oh! Uh. Don't worry, it's not real. Jameson, why are we taking on water? Captain, there's a whale! Oh god, a whale! Abandoned ship! Abandoned, Abandoned ship! Burn. Why hello to you too, Topeka. Growl. <laughs> and as you can see, we have the tracks of the Scroggle Donkus right here. Now if we follow them, we may be able to find them. <laughs> Did you hear that? Okay, me neither. See that it keeps going. The Scroggle Donkus likes to hide its tracks. Oh my god, there's more tracks over here. The Scroggle Donkus must be hiding. Did you hear that? Yeah, me neither. As you can see, the Scroggle Donkus likes to hide its tracks. It tries very hard. Oh my god, look, there's even more tracks now. We must be on the tail of this scroggle dog. I can hear it nearby. We gotta find him. He could be the last of his species. There's more. He keeps multiplying. I'm gonna beat him this time. Ah, I'm parched. What? But I'm thirsty. I got one. <laughs> I'm still thirsty. Ah! You know, this is my type of exploration. A nice rain. Ah, you got the fog all messed up. There we go. So this is actually how an igloo works. You see, on the outside it's all cold and gross, but on the inside it's a tropical rainforest. Ah, hello, my gentleman. Uh, do you have any Fruit Loops for me? Uh, oh, okay. I, I'm sorry, dude. I, I, didn't, I didn't mean to offend you. Uh, I, I, my bad. My bad. Uh, no. Uh. Ah, pu. Ah, man. This is why you don't get skunks. They smell so nasty. Brother, I have come to free you. 
but I forgot the file. One day I will free you. I will free you all. Oh my god, he's drowning! No! Oh, he's fine now. Yo, girl. You want me to warm up that cold heart of yours? Oh, sorry, dude. Uh, I didn't mean that. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, no, no offense, man. No offense. Ah, otters are my favorite. Look at them go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they're so cute. <laughs> I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Wow, next time it's snowing, I'll make sure I go to the zoo. That's all we have for today, Vikes. Make sure you come out and support your Vikes tonight at the basketball games. Hope everyone had a great time at Snowball. <laughs>